Started with jumping jacks. That's no surprise. As usual, this does not feel good in your body. It's a warm up. Do something else. This is your guys' workout. So I know we were super low on the cardio last week, partially because it was really hot, partially because I didn't feel so good. So don't worry, you'll be sweating today. All right, last three, two, and time. Let's go right into those high knees. Get those arms moving, knees up. Oh, Apple Watch, I just saw Mackenzie do it. Start your timers. Otherwise, we're gonna have to redo the workout. All right, 10 seconds, guys. We're going to our butt kickers. All right, final five, four, three, two, and time. All right, butt kickers, just jog into place. Are the twins already in Halloween outfits, Katie? I can't, they're so cute. All right, 10 seconds. I got to see them on Sunday, they're so big. It's ridiculous. All right. Final five, four, three, two, and time. All right, we're doing windmills, stretching it out. Man, my hair didn't even make it through the warm up. It's not a good sign. All right, keep doing windmills. I'm gonna fix my bun. Almost there, guys. We got 10 seconds. And final five. Four, three, two, and time. Okay, so your workout, do it at your pace, modify when you need to. We may have two extra that have burpees in it. Sorry, um, get water when you want. All right, we're starting out. So we're gonna do a squat twist press. So guys, you can go between like a five and a 10 here. We're gonna squat. Press, squat, press. If you don't have weights or anything heavy, you can just literally just punch, but punch with like aggression, like you, or you can do with these guys too. Squat, press, squat, press. All right, so grab your things. No yawning, I saw you. Three, two, and let's go. So nice and low, I'm twisting and I'm pressing. So I'm getting into those obliques as well. Use that power from your glutes so you're not just squatting and standing, pressing. It's one motion, squat, twisting. That's gonna engage that core. Nice, you guys. Start off a little easy today. Continuing that warm up, just getting upper and lower body moving together. Think about the weights you're using this round, and can we go up on the second round, okay? I really want us focusing on lifting heavier when we can, when it's safe to do so. 10 seconds, guys. And five, four, three, two, and time. All right, woo, already out of breath. Okay, guys, we're gonna go into a bicep curl and core at the same time. What that looks like, so again, this can be on the lighter side, okay? Um, so between like a five and a 10 again, your legs are gonna come out like this. You're gonna hold these guys in and we're going to rotate the bicep curl. So. Elbows do not leave your side. You're doing an external rotation in a static bicep curl. If you need to, tap legs down. You can even alternate them. So it does not have to be crazy heavy. For those without any weights at all, I'm gonna have you do these guys. The second round, I'm gonna have you hold a boat pose. So I'm just gonna break it up for you guys, okay? If you have weights, Join me on the ground. You can go a little bit lighter than you normally would. We're gonna start this in three, two, and let's go. So legs are in boat pose, elbows are glued by your side. You're hollowing out that core. If you feel this in your lower back, your hip flexors, tap the heels down. 
Just lean back. I can absolutely feel my abs there. Maybe we raise a leg, come back down, raise a leg, come back down. Come back up, hold it, play with this. Just keep those arms moving. Make sure we feel nothing in that lower back. Almost there, guys. If you're doing those bicep curls with the resistance band, keep going. You'll get your core on round two. All right, guys, 10 seconds. Everyone up, everyone up. We got five, four, three, two, and time. Nice, you guys. I know that one's challenging. If anyone's lower back hurt, make sure your heels stay on the ground the second round, okay? We wanna make sure we're working lower abs, not lower back. All right, so I'm gonna have you guys stand up. We're gonna do a reverse lunge in two of front raise. So I'm gonna show you guys with the resistance bands first. So reverse lunge, come back to center, okay? That's resistance band. Otherwise, grab your weights. We're gonna come and come back. We're gonna work one leg, one motion, then we'll do the other leg and do the side raises, okay? Again, we can do lighter weights today. So make sure you're not engaging your traps or engaging the shoulders. We're starting this in three, two, and let's go. Reverse lunge and back in, nice. Yours is coming from your back, your shoulder blades, not your neck, not your traps. If this feels too much, control it. That's fine. I wanna make sure we're working the deltoids, not these upper neck muscles, okay? So be mindful of form, and you also drop it. Focus on that leg. That's fine today. I know that the, the front lunge, front raises, excuse me, can pull on people's necks a ton. Almost there, guys. We're gonna do three seconds, then we're gonna hold that lunge and pulse in two, and hold it down and pulse. Pulse the lunges. I'm really in the weights of my chest. You guys are holding them out. <laughs> Last five, four, three, two, and shake it out. Nice, Angela, you held those out. Damn, I was like, I'm bringing them down. I don't know about you guys. Okay. Other leg, other shoulder raise, okay? We're starting this in three, two, and let's go. Reverse lunge, and back to center. Same thing you would do if you have the mini bands. And again, if this feels a lot on your shoulder, your neck, just alternate them. All right. Make sure that core is in tight. We're still focusing on that lunge, too. Not just about the shoulders. 15 seconds. Option to bring the weights down. And we're just going to pulse the leg in 10. Almost there, guys. Five, four, three, two. Hold it down. Almost there, guys. We got 10 seconds. Nice job, you guys. Noel, well, Angela, holy cow. You're gonna do three, two, and time. All right. Again, water, towel, whenever you need it. Make sure you're hydrating. Because this is gonna be some of that cardio, maybe some of that burpee that I was talking about. So watch me. We're gonna start with this. We're jumping out to a sumo squat, jumping into a jump squat, jumping out to a burpee, back in. I know, you love me. Everyone's so glad they came. All right, out, in, back, up. As usual, can we move the burpee? You can focus just on heavy lifting, all right? Decide which path you are taking. All right, three, two, and let's go. Jumping out to a sumo squat, into a regular squat, back into a burpee, back to center, out to a sumo, into a regular, back to a burpee. Just like that, you guys. Modifications here are absolutely fine. You always have the option 
to go heavy instead of cardio. Stay with me, guys. We're all doing this together. We got 10 seconds. And five, four, three, two, and time. It's a really long 45 seconds. Really long. All right, guys, take a beat. We're gonna come to our next thing. We need to lay down. Well, you need to lay down if you have dumbbells. So, I will show you what we're doing. We're gonna start with your weight straight up. You're gonna thrust your hips up, open to a fly. Come back in. Thrust up, fly, come in, and down. If your weights are too heavy for a fly, that is fine. Stick with the chest press, okay? If you do not have weights, you're gonna join me and on your knees or on your feet, push-ups, okay? So we're working chest here, secondary muscle is glutes. I'm gonna get this set up. You're doing a fly or a chest press, depending on the how heavy your weights are. In three, two, let's go. Starting with my weights up, glute comes up, Arms open, slight bend in those elbows. Weights come up, glutes go back down. <sighs> Squeezing your glutes at the top, controlling those arms. Make sure those elbows are not locked out. If this feels too challenging, go into a chest press. You can typically lift a heavier weight with a chest press than you can with a fly. There's no shame in modifying, it means you're listening to your body and you're doing the exercise properly. Almost there, guys. Stay with me, we got 15 seconds. Last 10. And five, four, three, two, and time. Whew, I can't believe I let my glutes. All right, everyone. This is gonna be a little bit of, um, actually, this is gonna be this gonna be heavy lifting if you want. So, those of you that have heavier weights and we're waiting to do that, but you were done with all the jumping, we're gonna go ahead and do curtsy lunge, come back to center, regular narrow squat, back to center, curtsy lunge. If you do not have heavy weights or you want to keep with cardio, that's fine. Jump squat, curtsy and keep that pace up, okay? So heavy weights, cardio, choose your adventure. All right guys, I'm gonna go with the 15s for this one. We're starting this curtsy, squat, curtsy. Three, two, let's do this. Curtsy, back to center, nice low squat. Curtsy, perfect you guys. In a curtsy lunge, you're working the outside of that leg and that glute. You're pushing with the outside of that foot and heel, not into that quadricep and the knee. You're jumping, curtsy lunge, jump squat, curtsy lunge. Almost there, guys. 10 seconds. And we have five, four, three, two, and time, nice. Think about the weight you just used. If you have it in your resources at home, can you go up next time? Think about it, maybe not, maybe yes. Okay guys, this is the second burpee of the class. I have never in the history in 10 years done two burpees in a workout. Lucky you, there is no ladder, there's no ladder. What if I did a ladder burpee? Oh my God. All right, next week, I'll come next week. It's gonna be great. Okay, so here's what you're gonna do. I'm gonna use a 10 for this. So we're gonna do bent over double row, drop them kind of wide, come all the way down to your chest, come up. Oh, sorry, we're gonna do three rows. So one, two, three, 
out, and in. One, two, three. For those of you with out dumbbells, I'm gonna have you just do the burpee, okay? You have the option if you wanna come down and make it a tricep burpee, that's fine, okay? So, three bent over rows, one flat burpee, that is what we're doing. I'm using tens, just to put that in perspective. Okay guys, we're starting this in three, two, put this here so I can see our time, and begin. So, one, two, three, come all the way down, all the way, or half up. Now with the rows, guys, back is completely flat. Knees are really bent. You're working in between those shoulder blades, okay? Two, three, jump out, jump in. Come on, guys. It was supposed to be one row, one burpee, and I did this and I was like, that's really mean. So I added three rows. Almost there, guys. This one is gonna be a full minute. So that's 15 seconds. Last 10, guys. Come on, we got this. One more good one, all the way through. Let's go. And time. Two burpee exercise kind of day. Side bun. I thought Noelle was leaving. She just opened her door. I thought she was actually just leaving. Like, no, done. Crazy. You crazy lady. She's like, I don't really want to come today. I'm kind of tired. Like, yeah, two burpees. Okay. Oh yeah. So this is new and weird also. Um, but you can sit down, so you're welcome. All right. So it's gonna be core, shoulders, and triceps. Legs are gonna be straight. I like to start with it up and I'm leaning back. So, so much core here, right? Bring it down, shoulder press, tricep, lean back core, come down. Shoulder press, come up, tricep, lean down. Okay, those are your the cables. Have the cable attached, and I'm gonna have you alternate those arms with the cable, or you can come into your dips, okay? So, those of you with, uh, what do things called? Weights, <laughs> joining on the ground. I'm gonna use a 10, like eight to 15, eight to 20. See what feels good to you guys. All right, so, so I just start up and leaning back. Make sure you got that core. Starting in three, two, and let's go. We're gonna bring it down. I go back up, sit up, tricep extension, lean down, tons of core, shoulder press up, tricep extension, lean back, tons of core, come up, tricep extension. Again, we're thinking about this weight. I'm realizing I should definitely go up. What are you thinking? You have a second round to make those adjustments. Almost there, guys. Well, kind of almost there. I feel like this is the core a ton. Hopefully you guys are as well. 15 seconds. Make sure you're really leaning back. Hollowing out those abs. Belly button is fine. 10 seconds. And five, four, three, to end time. All right. If your shoulders and triceps weren't burning, which mine weren't, my weight was too light. So I'm gonna use the 15s. Think about that for next time, guys. All right. We're gonna do an oldie but a goodie. I'm gonna demo it on the cable first. I can't see anyone using cables, but I don't know. I'm gonna do it anyways. So if you're using cables, Stand on them, cross them. You're gonna do narrow row, wide row, okay? If you are not, you're gonna grab this guy, we're gonna come into a deep lunge, and we're gonna go narrow and wide, okay? You know what, sorry, let's make it easier. If you're using cables, you're just gonna go narrow, 
And then when I have uh, everyone else switch their, um, their arm, then you're gonna go wide. Hopefully that makes sense. So, okay. Everyone with dumbbells, grab what you're gonna use. We're gonna go deep into that front lunge, starting in three, two, and let's go. So narrow and wide. Nice. Is it a Noel just go narrow or just go wide? Because I'm going to have you switch. Yeah. I realized that that would be really mean to make you do that for two minutes. Not that it's any different. I guess somebody separated, but it feels more different. It looks like Katie's having a full on party over there. There's like streamers everywhere. Her workout looks better than mine. I want streamers. Well, then you got Cynthia over there. She might be winning the workout wall. All right, 10 seconds, guys. We're doing 45 seconds of this. Then cables are gonna switch to um, wide rows and dumbbells, switch arms. All right, guys, quick shake out. Get the other guy ready. Starting in three, two, let's go. We got narrow and wide and narrow and wide. This is totally my awkward side. You guys have an awkward side too? Like, it works really perfect on my right side. Then my left leg is way stronger than my right leg. All right. We got 20 seconds. Almost there. Last 15. And then we got one more thing. And we're gonna do it again. 10 seconds. And five. Four, three, two, and time. All right, nicely done, you guys. We're gonna end with some obliques, and then we're gonna do it again. It's gonna be awesome. Okay, so we haven't done this exact thing before. Make sure you come onto the soft part of your butt, not your bone, because that's gonna hurt. So, you're gonna come like this, just hanging out. You're gonna come in and up. So crunch in, crunch up. If that's not happening, this is fine. You can absolutely just do that. If you want to go for the challenge, legs never hit the ground. You're going to go in, extend out, side V up, extend out. Feet do not hit the ground. Come on down and join me. This is beginning. In three, two, and let's go. So crunch in, extend out, V up, extend out, crunch in, extend out, V up, extend out. Nice, you guys. Modify this by doing just the V up or just the crunch, totally up to you. We're doing 10 seconds, not a crazy long time. You got three, two, and time. All right, dude, those totally got me. Holy cow. All right, other side. Come on to the soft part of your booty. Legs are out. It's happening. Three, two, let's go. Crunch in, extend out, V up. There we go. Yeah. I have a weird core side too. What's going on? Almost there, guys. 10 seconds. And five, four, three, two, and time. Cynthia, you're right. The second side is way harder. I made her do those in the workout, and then in the second side, each, no matter what side we did, was way harder. Why is that? We must be using. That's so, so baffling, guys. It's just baffling. Okay, stand up. If you haven't drink water, you should. We just didn't have the workout. You should be hydrating. All right, is everyone good? Happy? Excited? Yep, that's what I like to see. Okay, what do we start with? Oh yeah. Remember, can you go up in the weights? Challenge yourself. I'm going up. Who's joining me? Squat, twist, squat, twist. Okay, grab your weights. Starting in three, two,
two, let's go. Squat, twist, squat, twist. Remember, you can do this with the cables. You can also do this with no weights. And make sure you're twisting. Get that whole twist. Yep. So you're crossing that weight across your face. Nice. Nice adjustment. Nice, you guys, because that's giving me obliques, right? Look at that. That's all my core holding that up. So you're feeling that. It's a twist. It's a punch. Remember, if you start heavy, you can go back down. There's no rules. That's how you're going to get stronger. All right, 15 seconds. We're still doing that minute here. Last 10. And five, four, three, two, and time. All right. Whew. Totally tell the difference there. Holy moly. Okay. So, meet me on the ground. We're going to do those weird V up with static bicep curl. So, this one, you may want to keep the weight, might, might keep the weight the same. They're pretty challenging. Legs are going to be straight, arms in, and we're going to rotate these guys. Absolutely fine, especially if you want to use a heavier weight for the biceps to keep those heels on the ground. Okay, guys? Starting this in three, two, and let's go. So you're leaning back. We have that core engaged, working those biceps. Maybe you raise a leg, and then the other. Then you both come up for a second. Maybe you bend the knees a little bit. Make it yours, guys. Bring them back down. If your lower back starts to hurt, you put those heels on the ground right away. Right away. Really focusing on leaning back and getting in to those biceps with that rotation. 10 seconds, guys. All right. We're all holding up in three, two, five seconds. No one drops. Five, four, three, two, time. You guys are amazing. Thank you for doing that with me. All right. What do we got? Oh, yeah. We're going to do reverse lunges with shoulder things. So, first we're going to start reverse forward. We'll do the whole thing, then we'll do the other leg, but go side. Dude, my hair is just like, looks like a little like side hair hat, like a tea party. I have a tea party hair hat. Okay, this is happening. Three, two, and let's go. Reverse, come back up. Now, I'm pulling that core. Watch my profile. I'm coming straight back, 90 degrees, and forward. Watching that core, watching your lower back. And if you don't have tension on the cables, you can crisscross those handles. Almost there. Stay in with this, guys. We're gonna hold it down, just do the lunge. Unless you wanna keep the, the raises. In three, two, Hold it down, repulse in the lunge. Nice. You're welcome to hold the cable, the cables up. My arms are just tired. Five, four, three, two, and shake it out. All right. Other leg, side raises. Let's do this. All right, guys. Three, two, and begin. Side. Come back to center. Again, maintain that control. You're still thinking about pressing into that heel, that front foot. Your knee is directly in line with your ankle. You're not sacrificing that lunge. Nice. Pulling that belly button to spine every time you go back. 10 seconds, we're just pulsing those legs. In five, four, 
three, two, and pulse your legs. 15 seconds. Shoulder blades are back. Relax. All legs here, guys. Final. Three, two, and ten. All right, shake it out. Grab some water. Towel off if you need to. We're getting ready for our next guy. And yeah, it's the first burpee of round two. Have you blocked it out? I'll review it for you. So, sumo, regular, burpee, one. Sumo, regular, burpee, one. If jumping is not happening, hold the weight, make it heavy. You have to challenge yourself. I don't care how you modify it. All right, team. Three, two, let's go. Sumo, regular, burpee, up. Sumo, regular, burpee, up. Just like that, guys. Listen to your body. If you need to do something a little different, that's fine. Every day, every round, every person is a little different. As long as you're challenging yourself, do you. 10 seconds, guys. And five, four, three, two, and time. All right, there's an interim hair break. How come no one else's hair is doing a thing? What's happening? What kind of scrunchies are you all using? Send them to me. All right, team. Get to lay down. It's the fly hip thrusting portion of your workout. Remember, if you don't have weights, you're gonna do that push-up, either tricep or regular. I'm gonna go with a 10 pounds for this for flies. Um, if your weight's too light, I'm sorry, too heavy, up for a chest press, okay guys? So remember, it's like this. You thrust up, you open up, come back, and down. All right guys, make the adjustments you need to. This is starting in three, two, let's go. So thrust up, open up into that fly. You're gonna use that ground as your spotter. You're pressing through those heels, squeezing your butt as hard as you can, controlling it back down. We are working both muscle groups evenly here. Thrust up, open with control, slight bend in those elbows, and back down. Awesome, you guys. Remember, if the weight's too heavy, go with that chest press that normally likes a little heavier weight than a fly. 15 seconds. We are almost there, guys. Give me last five, four, three, two, and time. All right. Lovely job, guys. We're in that final, final stretch now. Nothing else. Leave it all here. Don't save any gas in the ignition, or the tank, not the ignition. Go hard, do all the things. All right, so this is gonna be heavier lifting. Go as heavy as you can. Curtsy, narrow squat, curtsy. If you wanna go cardio, remember, you're going curtsy, jump squat curtsy. If you have 15s, pick them up. If you have 20s, grab them. Come on, guys. Challenge time. We're starting this in three, two, let's go. Curtsies, narrow squat, curtsies. Nice, I'm liking what I'm seeing, guys. Focus on form. If you tried something that was too heavy, things are getting wonky, put it down, no shame in that. And always up for that cardio if you're just, man, I really want to jump right now. What's wrong with you, but 15 seconds, guys. All right, 
Still heavier than they did last round. Almost there. Final 10. Let's do this. And five, four, three, two, and time. Man. Oh, my legs are gonna feel that tomorrow. Okay, guys. Final stretch. Like I was telling you, I'm gonna hydrate real quick. Okay. That's the second burpee of round two. We're gonna do three rows, drop them, come flat, come up three rows. If you don't have dumbbells, we have you do the regular burpee. You can add the push up, either regular or tricep. Both can be done on your knees and your fists, okay? Let's do this. Starting in three, two, and let's go. Three rows, two, three. Drop the weights down, all the way flat, guys. Come back up. Let's row. Come on, squeezing those shoulder blades. Your back is so flat here. We're feeling nothing in that lower back. So the generous bend in those knees the entire time. We have the final stretch. What do you got left? Come on. Push yourself. Can you pick that pace up a little more? It's the last burpee. 15 seconds. Let's go all out. Come on. 10 seconds, guys. How many can you get in? In five, four, three, two, and time. Oh. Wow. That was super fun. Okay. Oh. I was worried about giving you another ladder. So God, I didn't do that. For those of you that missed the last couple weeks, the ladders were ridiculous. I'll just leave it there. I'll take a, a tally of double burpees or ladders, which one we like more. All right, three things, three fun things. Okay, so we're gonna do the, um, like lean back, shoulder press, tricep, thing with jig. Um, I used a 10, it was way too light. So if your weight was too light, go up. If you um, do not have dumbbells, this time I'm gonna have you do shoulder press. I know last time I had you do triceps, this time you're gonna do overhead shoulder press. Ooh, man, I lost. You know, blocked out for a second. All right, so let me review what we're doing. Hold the weight, start up, leaning back. I want this hollowed out. Your abs should be shaking. Come down, press up, tricep, come down. Yeah, that's a way better weight. Go up, people. All right, starting in three, two, and time. So start up, lean back, bring it down, Sit up, go back, tricep, come up, lean back, come down. Sit up, weight goes up, tricep. Come up, lean back, weight comes down. Just like that, you guys. I gotta find the right way to hold this. I think this will want to be best with a kettlebell. That's okay. Stay in with this, guys. We are doing that full minute. Holy cow. You can definitely tell I went up in the weight now. Almost there, you guys. 10 seconds. This should be hard. You should be shaking. Five, four, three, two, finish strong. Time. Holy moly. Oh. When you guys are doing your solo workouts, if you're not dying at the end of the exercise, add a pulse, add five more reps. Sometimes I know we all can't go up in weights, but there's still ways to make it hard. You should be shaking. You should, muscles should be feeling fatigued. Two more things. So we're gonna do, yeah, this guy. So in, out. 
For those with cables, either do just ins or just outs. Same if you're doing them like this. Got it? Hopefully that made sense to you, all my cable friends. Okay, grab your things. All right, I'm gonna try to go up on this one too. If you go up, watch the wide row, guys. I don't want you working your trap. You wanna work your shoulder, this really sexy area on everyone's back. Um, so make sure you get that and not go back down. They're talking in code right now. Like go up, go down. Cable, good. All right, it's happening. Three, two, let's go. Narrow, wide. Oh, I got this, yeah. All right. I was doubting myself round one. All right, 30 seconds, guys. We're doing 45 seconds each way. Remember, we're working right where that bra strap goes in the bottom of your bra strap. We're not working your trap. Long lean necks. 15 seconds. You got this. Final 10. So we got one more exercise. Come on. Five, four, three, two, and time. Holy moly. Okay. Oh, all right. You guys all ready to do the other side already? Okay. I'm up. Is this happening? Oh no, wait, wait. My iPod just like turned off. It's like, no, we're done. Hold on. Technical error. Got it. And we're good. Other side. Three, two, and let's go. All right. Narrow and wide. Oh, this is my weird side. Narrow and wide. If you have a side where it's harder to engage the muscle, it's helpful to like tap that muscle and squeeze it before you do the exercise. That way you're kind of activating it or even doing it a couple rows without a weight and trying to squeeze and get that muscle going. 15 seconds. Woo. Last 10. And there's only one more thing left. Five. Four, three, two, and time. Oh, okay. Wow. I feel like we did all the things. There's still one more. Okay. It's the double side crunch. So find the nice soft part of your booty. Okay, unless it's all rock hard just for this workout, then I'm sorry. So sorry. All right, legs up. You're gonna crunch in and up. Wouldn't that be so cool? Like if you did a really good workout and you just woke up and you're like, yep, done. Can't get better. All right, ready? Three, two, let's go. Legs straight. You're crunching in, out, side B up. Remember, you can take one of the crunches off. As long as you're getting into those obliques, I don't care how you do it. That's all you gotta do, guys. This is it. You guys kicked butt tonight. Oh. It was just so hot last week. I don't know. It was hard. I was feeling the energy today. I think it's Cynthia's wall. I think I just went into a trance. I don't know what's happening. It could be eight o'clock right now for all I know. We're just gonna keep doing this all night. Just this one side, okay? Three, two, and time. All right, other side's happening. What time is it? Oh, I'm almost on time, I'm one minute over. That's okay. All right guys, three, two, let's do it. Legs straight, in, extend, just like that. Remember, unless you're under a rock, you've seen, you can bring a friend for free the first time. So if your friends are not working out, they're in a slump, invite them to come join us. I swear, this Wednesday workout like totally invigorates me. Especially if people are going through kind of depression or they just kind of just can't get into their routine. Bring them, have them join the fun. 10 seconds. Almost there. You got five, four, three, Two and time. All right. 
Well, 